Hello, and welcome back to Rusty Bucket Bay in Banjo Kazooie Speedish Run with your host, me, Banjo Kazooie. Oops. Okay. Come on. I need health. Ah, come on. They're so close to each other. Oh, but luckily there's two guys in here. Okay, now health. I'm in a much better situation than I was. And uh, then let's get those four, and let's raise the anchor and get another jiggy. I don't know where this little guy goes. Yeah, poop out the jiggy, and then swim away, even though you're a mammal. Or... Are dolphins mammals? I think dolphins are mammals. They breathe air, certainly. So, that thing should have drowned, like, hours ago. Before I got here, it should have drowned. But nah, it's fine. I also need to find the eggs. Oh, there's one. The exit of the evil water. Okay. Okay, I'm okay. Everything's fine. Let's just get this jiggy. And surface as fast as you can. Don't don't try to um swim faster underwater because you'll lose your air twice as fast as above water. And it's just a bad idea. Okay, I don't know if I went through this. I probably did. I think this goes to the kitchen. Oh no, I haven't been in here. Oh, right, that one actually explodes and hurts you. There might be a Jiggy in here. But there's certainly music notes. And if I ever find myself needing health, I can come back. Which, I do. So I can't come back here and get health because I got it all. Oh! But that doesn't change the fact that I got all the health. So this is just... Ooh, there's a gold feather. But yeah, this is just music notes. And ammo. So it's a good thing I went in there. But it doesn't help really in the long run. And so that's the engine room. I think it's time. Oh boy. Alright. Oh, there's a couple healths in here. Healths? Health is not a word that you should um, pluralize, I suppose. One health, two healths. Maybe it's like fish. Well, no, not like fish, but... Like moose. One moose, two moose. Three moose, four. Ugh. Okay, let's see. How many music notes do I have? 88. So I'm missing 12, so it's 1, 2, 3, 4s, so that's all the music notes right here in the engine room. It's important that I get the music notes before I die, because I know I'm going to die. Oh, see, see, I told you I was going to die. That's my first death, so she's gonna bark at me. Ugh. 
Okay, that's actually better than I thought it would be. Okay, that's not so bad. The punishment for death is not as bad as I anticipated. I thought... I mean, I suppose this will happen if I get a game over, but I thought that the notes came back as well. Or, yeah, so you had to grab them all again in order, or before you can start adding up. So if I got all 100, then I would still have the best note score of 100, and I wouldn't need to worry about them coming back and having to collect them all again. But, that was uh, a fear that's completely unfounded in facts. So, this, it's a, still a hard room. That, that ha much hasn't changed, but it's not as bad as I thought. As long as I don't have to press the button again. Oh my god, I have to press the button again. And then, so there's that switch, which will slow it down, and then there's a jiggy. And then there's that switch, which will also slow it down, and an extra life. So I need to go back to the stern end of the ship again. And hit that switch that slows the propellers. Okay, so next time I die, I will remember that. Ugh. Honestly, if it wasn't for this room, I could do this game without dying. Completely possible. Wait. No, I don't need to leave the level. What the hell am I thinking? I just need to go back to the stern. And jump in the exhaust port, porthole, whatever. No, portholes are windows. So this, the one that's not as bright... And ground pound this again. And this slows down these propellers, and I can get that jiggy. And the music notes. And press the other two propeller buttons. I don't know why I picked that up. I'm not coming back in here. And then I can get out and go down into the water through the propellers that are directly below me. And grab the final jiggy and never come back to this godforsaken level again. If only there were some tricks. I mean, I suppose I could have um, saved myself, or had a better shot at least, of not dying this first time had I used the Talon Trot and made Kazooie walk. Because she has better traction. And she might not have fallen. I also could have just had some frickin' patience and not jumped on it while it was spinning so fast. Maybe in Nintendo 64, when you die, the notes reset. I think that's true. Because I know I remember it happening to me sometime, but it, it must be when you get a game over. Which, uh, coincidentally, you get a game over if you choose save and quit. Because Gruntilda's just mean like that. Anyway, there you go. 100. And a Jiggy. Okay. This engine room isn't too bad. Um. No, I should do this one second. I shouldn't. Not not until. Not worth the risk. All right. Now, because of the nature of this, wait. Could I just sneak in 
two through those slow moving ones? Do I need to hit them both? I don't know. But because of the nature of this, when I hit the next switch, it will uh, start a timer. And so I'm going to keep the level or the video going even though we're at time. I just need to find a good time to hit it. Now these stop, and a timer comes up. Oh god, like a minute? Oh, it stops everything! Except, uh, those things. I don't even know what these are. What purpose does this have? Okay, engine room done with only one death. I think that's some sort of record. Uh, when I was a kid, man, that that engine room was terrible. And I still have 30 seconds to jump in the water and grab the final jiggy, and then I'm done in Rusty Bucket Bay. I am surprised it was this quick. Of course, I still have to get in. Come on. There we go. Let's, uh, aim me at the thing. Okay, that didn't work. Oh god, that kills you instantly. Surprise, that kills you instantly. Huh. <laughs> I hate underwater when you can't... No, oh, I need to go into the thing. Damn, I, I guess I spoke too soon. Um, I'm gonna go in to this thing, and I'm gonna end the episode. God, that's embarrassing. So, okay, see you guys tomorrow, and I will finish Rusty Bucket Bay.